What is happening, y'all? Hey, um, I felt like making this video. I saw uh, um, this video is for Ryan Up Church. I don't know if you'll ever see this video, but um, I felt kind of compelled to make this video. I saw I saw your your recent video. Um, it was a uh, it was heartbreaking. It was uh, about people that you thought were your friends and. Um, I've sat back over the last several years and watched some of the things that's transpired in your life, um, some of the things that you went through, and um, it's been it's been heartbreaking for a fan of your music to uh, to sit and watch you go through those things. And um, I know that you're a strong person. I know that you're a you're a kind person, and um, it just uh, amazes me sometimes the the level that some people will stoop that you think that are your friends. Um, I've been there. I've thought people were my ride or die and come to find out they weren't, you know, I mean, and it hurts. It really does. It, it, it hurts, you know, coming from a, from someone that does have a kind heart that tries to help people. Um, it does, it hurts, but I, I never thought that, you know, I started reacting to music as an escape to battle my depression after losing, you know, my mother-in-law, my mother, um, some close friends in my life. Um, some of them, some of them passed away. Some of them are still living. I mean, not everybody has to die to lose them. And I never thought that reacting to, you know, the very first song I reacted to was Dirty Elvis in, um, you know, I reacted to Pond Creek Road and same old, same old. And I never thought that reacting to music would bring people into my life. And people that I'm, you know, I've got friends that I've had since I was 10 years old. And I'm, I'm pretty close to them. You know, we've, we've been there for each other. But I've, I've recently had, you know, people come into my life that, um, that had nothing to gain from being my friend. You know, people like Troy Hill. I never will forget, you know, I, I rented a cabin in Indiana. Um, I continued that on. It was something that we did for my mother for her birthday. And it was something that I carried on doing. Last year, I rented the cabin and um, Troy Hill and his wife and his son Ryden um, came just to spend some time with me and my son. Had nothing to gain from that. And um, it was it was such a good time. It was some great memories, and um, and it, he's been part of my everyday life. He'll message me early in the morning, "Hey, bro, what's up?" You know, um, I never thought that it would bring me so close to people, and it's all because of your music. It's all because of Creek Squad. It's all because of. Um, the passion and love people have for each other in their music. Not everybody is bad. Not everybody is out to to get something or gain something from you. I have nothing to gain for even making this video. But um, it has. It's brought people into my life. And I want to thank you for that. You know, there's people like Alan Carter, um, Cardiac Kid, Ords, um, that so many others. I mean, there's there's just a countless list of people that's that's just uh, daily. You know, um, they send me messages. They'll comment on my stuff. Um, How you doing, Buckeye? Um, it's it's um it's been something that, you know, I've I've loved a lot of different types of music all my life, and I've never had, you know, I've never gained family by listening to Metallica or. To Johnny Cash. I mean, yeah, we share the same, com uh, the same, you know, common things sometimes with some of my friends, but nothing on on this level, nothing on um, this level of of these people being in my daily life. And um, you know, I just want to thank you for that. Not everybody's out to get you. Not everybody's out to try to gain something from you. We all appreciate your music. We hate to see. You go through things when you hurt, we hurt. Um, we've all been hurt over just uh, watching some things transpire in your life. And it's, um, 
it's been hurtful, but we've all been there. We've all, we've all had people do those things to us. People that we thought were our friends, um, has hurt us, has stolen from us, has, you know, um, talked behind our backs, you know, weaseled their way around and done shady stuff to us. And that, that hurts, but there's people that you can 100% trust in this life. I believe I found a few, um, that are like that. And it's all because of your music. They're genuine people. Um, I don't know what I'd do without them. You know, we help each other. We build each other up. And that's what we're all about. And um, I want to thank you for that. Honestly, thank you so much for that. That we can sit there and watch you take all these things and still get up. Still make music. Um, still do shows still care about your fans, still care about people, um, watched you do things out of the kindness of your heart, people that don't even get seen on YouTube or Instagram or anything like that. And, um, that's who we are. That's what we're made of. There's some people just not cut from that same cloth. And, um, I realize that, but it does, it, you can't say that it don't hurt when you lose somebody um, that's still alive. I think that's the worst type of hurt is losing somebody when they're still breathing. And it's because of the things that they've done to you. But then they'll turn around and try to act like it was you. They'll try to turn around and act like it was something that you did. And um, and that's, that's just how shallow some people are. That's just how weak they are, you know. Um, they try to play the tough guy put on the tough guy act, but deep down inside they're weak. And um, it's sad to see stuff like that. It really is. But, you know, some of us kind of knew that all along. You know, I I don't like when I get those vibes. Um, but when I do, I realize that they're usually 100% correct. Um, I wish they weren't. I wish they weren't right. Um, I told my wife, I said, man, I, I just wish that I didn't have this. But, um, man, lift your head up. You know, we are them holler boys. We are the ones that do stuff for people, that help people, that try to build people up instead of tear them down. Um, don't say nothing behind people's backs, but try to have each other's back. And uh, I just want to thank you for, for the music, for, for one thing, um, being true to yourself and who you are, and for bringing people into my life. I just want to thank you for that. And, um, man, keep your head up, man. Um, I know that you always do. You're a strong person. You're um, the strongest person that that I've seen. <laughs> you are the Waylon Jennings of the music industry, and I believe that. But with that, man, I, I just want to thank you again. I could never say enough. I am that guy that has the Creek Squad on his tailgate, holler boy on his window and um, tries to treat people good, even though they've done me wrong. But with that, I'll catch you all later. And another thing I found out about um, Troy and his wife, Sarah, um, when I rented the cabins in in a rented a cabin in Indiana um, for my mother's birthday. My mother's birthday is on October 26th. And um, I found out that, that Troy and his wife, Sarah, both of their birthdays are on my mother's birthday. So I don't think that's too much of a coincidence. It's a, it's amazing how, how um, God brings people into your life. And um, somehow I think my mother has something to do with that. Losing her was tough. And I, I miss our daily talks, but these people are in my life on a daily. And um, thank you for that. I wanted to add that because I forgot it. And also, I've, I've just seen that, um, that you're going to have a baby. So <laughs> congratulations, man. Um, nothing has been life-changing to me than, than having my own kids. And I could provide something that I never had. Um, to them and now I've got two grandkids 
So it, it's, um, it's been a life changing um, time in my life. But with that, man, again, congratulations. You got something to look forward to and keep your head up. Appreciate you.